U.S. airstrikes in response to Houthi attacks. The United States has conducted 230 airstrikes in Yemen following Houthi-led attacks on shipping vessels in the Red Sea. These strikes represent a significant response to the ongoing conflict. Last month, American forces intercepted ships, transporting lethal aid from Iran to the Houthis, including drone components, missile warheads, and anti-tank missile assemblies. Deputy Assistant Secretary of Defense Daniel Shapiro emphasized that this aid violated international law. Despite the U.S. strikes, the Houthi group remains committed to maritime attacks, utilizing their remaining weapons inventory. Congressional testimony and Red Sea battle. Tim Lenderking, the U.S. envoy for the Yemen conflict, and Daniel Shapiro testified before Congress. This marked the first time U.S. officials addressed the situation since President Joe Biden ordered strikes against the Houthis in an effort to halt their Red Sea attacks. Recently, U.S. Central Command reported that they shot down five Houthi-1 attack airborne drones in the Red Sea. American strikes on Yemen are named Operation Poseidon Archer, start date since January 12, 2024, approximately one month and two weeks ago. United States and United Kingdom, with support from Australia, Bahrain, Canada, Denmark, the Netherlands, and New Zealand participated. Objective was, in response to Houthi attacks on ships, in the Red Sea, the joint forces launched a series of cruise missile and airstrikes, codenamed as Operation Poseidon Archer, aimed at degrading Houthi capabilities to attack Red Sea commercial ships, not primarily intended to kill leaders or Iranian trainers. American fighter jets armed with precision-guided bombs were dispatched from regional bases, casualties, one MQ-9 Reaper drone shot down, Houthi casualties, at least five people killed and six wounded. Background of this operation was, Houthi attacks on commercial ships in the Bab el Mandeb Strait escalated during the Israel-Hamas war. The Houthis declared support for Hamas and targeted vessels transiting the Red Sea. These airstrikes have significant implications for the ongoing conflict in Yemen and the security of the Red Sea region. We will present the timeline and targets details, the effects, and reactions of the strikes in details later on.